<laughs> Guess what, guys? It's the first day of vlogmas. Yana wanted me to do vlogmas because she said that it's finally my time to shine. I didn't say that. Let me pull it up. <laughs> Really quickly, I'm actually gonna pull it up because I you literally- I this thing, I was hacked. And there you have it, folks. A cold, hard liar. You're making it seem like I said something I didn't say, which is really embarrassing, honestly. <laughs> On your For bio. You. <laughs> <laughs> it is actually November 26th, but since I have college and finals and stuff, I'm just pre-filming a ton of things. But they're normally, they're gonna be like more up to date, but today is just a big day in my life. Um, I have a lot of tow truck drama, which you guys will get to that point. I gotta get a bunch of packages, lots of stuff. It's Monday, I just got back from Thanksgiving break. So yeah, basically, gonna be having a lot of fun this Vlogmas. I've done Vlogmas in the past like five years. Oh, thank God. I'm so excited. Finally, so beautiful. Um, thanks, Yana. You see, I couldn't, yeah, okay. So I got my oats that I love. Actually, I'm lying. It's Gian on Buddy, whatever. It's very good. And then I got an iced oat milk. No, I got an iced dirty chai with oat milk. I can't speak. And I got a breakfast burrito. I literally spent $30 here. It's disturbing, but the breakfast burrito will be for lunch later. A disability. <laughs> Language, but she's spoken forever. But when she like when she learned to read it or to write it or to speak it or whatever, she like learned it by doing all, pretty much all of them at the same time. So she doesn't like reading basically because she has to like it takes her a second or whatever. It's like like whatever. Right, we get it. Yes, yeah, so I'm dyslexic. <laughs> I think you're not dyslexic. You're bilingual. <laughs> she's acting like it's a horrible thing. <laughs> um. Okay, I just had a really unfortunate series of events since Thanksgiving break. So I accidentally I. Let me give you a little sure story time. I would hope so. <laughs> you have my key. Yay. So I meant to leave my key in LA, right? I left my car in front of my house and then like the day before they were like, oh, we're having turkey trot, which I meant to leave my key here so that someone could move my car if it needed to be moved because I live in a neighborhood and normally they don't do that, but sometimes they do. So the night before my roommates text me and they're like, hey, we need to move your car. And uh, my key is somehow in Texas because I couldn't find it when I was leaving at 5 a.m. for my flight. I thought I left it on like a table somewhere. Nope, it was in my backpack the whole time. So totally my fault on that standpoint, right? So I'm like, awesome, that's Thursday, it gets towed. And then I was flying in Saturday night, so I was gonna miss, like I would land too late to pick up my car, couldn't get it Sunday because it's gonna be closed, had to get it Monday morning. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna overnight my key because it's gonna cost way more money. But it stays for the weekend, right? So I'm like, that's I'm gonna overnight my key and I'm gonna pay like $50 to overnight this key so that my one of my like roommates was gonna be an angel handle everything for me had all the paperwork everything ready to go because this is supposed to get here 10 30 on Saturday morning right come 11 30 on Saturday morning the key isn't there right so the key doesn't land doesn't get here until today because UPS messed it all up lied to us had horrible customer service which I'm sorry but it was just really disappointing so if you guys are trying to take Ship anything to FedEx it. Oh my you just, god. That car tried to hit us and we're Holy part of Yeah, stop saying bad words. <laughs> so then we got so basically my key came Monday when I could have just flown home with it and I'm just not getting to pick up my car and it's gonna be hundreds of dollars more. So that is my story. My first time getting my car towed, going to pick it up. It was my fault at first and then it was UPS. So UPS is canceled. You seriously better get your money back for the they should, yeah. You should, because it didn't work. Yeah, they literally, it was no reason. I went through all of that, you all of that, and they it. were not helpful at all, and they lied, and they tried to get me to switch my payment so I wouldn't have insurance on it. Did I tell you that? They tried no. to scam me out of my insurance. Yeah, not cool. Not cool. Um, I needed UPS to send me flowers, an apology, wow. all my money back, pay for this, yeah. give me a million dollars. That's what I mean. You, you could do it. I, I, yeah, that's my plan. So we're on our way to pick up my car. There's a first for everything. I'm glad I'm experiencing this with you, Yana. Going to pick up my car from getting towed. All right, guys, we made it. You see this? Give them a tour. Guys, tour. <laughs> Come egg this place, guys. Welcome to my new house. No, it's not their fault. It's UPS. <laughs> that's true. So weird. Yeah. This thing's getting Uh, silver BMW. Every day is Christmas, every day is Christmas, every day is Christmas.
It was only $500. Thought it was gonna be a lot more. It would have been $375 without UPS. Could have had my card two days ago. $500. Now I'm $500 poor. Reunited with my brand new car. That's mine. But I did get a wash last week and it does feel like a new car. So I'm going to pick up some packages. I'm hoping that they're here. I, like, I'm never home for signatures. I ran into the stranger! Guys, I'm just stupid. Like I really am just dumb so I wasn't thinking and I was like oh they didn't give me an address because the packages let's go to the post office because that's where all my packages are when I get these slips but they're FedEx slips and I never get FedEx slips so I just was like oh let's go to the post office the UPS post office so we go there stand in line and they're like it's FedEx and y'all just text me I can see you vlogging I can literally hear you basically she can't hear me but I'm an idiot um, I'm gonna go home and I'm actually gonna start filming some videos and stuff just to have ready for vlogmas because I'm gonna do like normal videos too but a lot of vlogs and like we'll do everyday uploads so excited if you guys are excited for vlogmas give this video a thumbs up join my Facebook page I still have tan this morning by the way sorry guys um join my Facebook page for my it's for my podcast but if you haven't listened to my podcast please do it's my baby it's my favorite thing in the world yeah the Facebook page we have a secret Facebook page right and it's been super fun so yeah, I'm so excited to be doing Vlogmas. I feel like I was really uninspired on my YouTube channel for a bit, and now I have all these really good video ideas, and I think that Vlogmas is just gonna put me back in the spirit. So, bye, Anna. I already miss her. Hmm. Okay, well, goodbye, everyone. Put on a Christmas movie. I'm back home. I'm gonna get ready and film. It really needs to be like Christmas here. I hate how it's not cold, but whatever. Okay, just got ready watching a Christmas movie, trying to get in the vibe of it. Uh, it's still playing. Did my makeup and my hair really quickly. I'm gonna change, go to my office, get to work. Gonna make some tea. Oh, look at my new, my old mug. That's so cute. Actually, uh, that's all I'm gonna use today. My old merch mug, show up and work hard. We have new ones out, guys. Check out all the new merch. It's so freaking cute. And we have two new mugs that are my favorite, but they're in my room, so we're not going to use them yet. Uh, okay. Got my tea. The office is ready. Got some Christmas music blaring. Okay. In my office, it's so good to have just a nice office day. I need to get my tripod. So I'm going to check my notes. Wow, the coloring is so something. Um go over some stuff see what i'm filming today i just had some of my breakfast burrito and i made some tea um but i'm so excited guys katie was home i threw a party. okay guys so i am on like afternoon slump like you know when you're like super productive and then it hits like two or three and you're just exhausted that's where i'm at um i just started rough cutting the video i just filmed doing some editing um and yeah so on the agenda for this month vlogmas um, finals week, I'm going back to Texas. We have limited edition merch for the month of December, so check that out if you guys are doing any like Christmas um, shopping. As always, I'm gonna be doing some gift guides. I'm really gonna be killing it on my Instagram story this month. So follow my Instagram because I'm gonna be having like a swipe up links to everything and obviously I'm gonna make them a highlight so you guys can go back to them and like have a lot of like shopping and just like gift ideas for anyone. Um, I'm so freaking tired right now, it's like painful, but I'm gonna get some work done. And I really wish that I had some friend who could come over and work today, but like everyone is busy and working normal jobs. That's the thing that sucks. It's like when your friends are all in college, they work like not for themselves, you know? Such a pain. Just doing some work, downloading some text fonts. I'm so stuck on what to do for my Vlogmas intro. By the time this is up, you guys have seen the Vlogmas intro. And hopefully it's good, but I'm just like stuck. I don't know what to do. I feel like my intros have recently been like really good, so I feel like I have to like make it really good. Okay, I got a box from Target. I'm not sure what this is. I recently ordered a ton of Christmas decor. Um, actually, my mom did and gifted it to us, which is so fun. I'm sorry, I'm so tired. What do you guys do when like the midday slump hits? I just like can't focus. I did like some schoolwork, and I like have. So I'm just kind of overwhelmed with how much is going on right now, but I'm tired, and I wish I had a friend. I wish that my friends were not so busy. 
Okay, so we have like multiple things coming, but um, the only thing that came today, these ornaments. How freaking cute. Uh, I'm so tired. Okay, so I just FaceTimed Taylor. <laughs> yeah, literally, I just FaceTimed Taylor and I was like, and I knew that she'd worked in her house all day today and I was like, wow, you look good. Can you explain to them why you do? Well, I took an Instagram, check it out. <laughs> she literally did all that to take an Instagram photo. Wait. You look good too though, your hair's curled. Thank you, I filmed a video. Oh, see? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I just took my makeup off and I'm honestly just gonna have a nice little self-care night routine. If you guys want to see my self-care night routine, I will have it linked down below. And when I forget to link it down below, let me know. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. We're gonna start doing comments of the day, if I remember. Um, comment of the day, whose vlogmas are you most excited for? I am hopefully Molly does hers and Danielle. So that's my answer. Let me know in the comments down below. Join our secret Facebook group. Let me know you guys want to see this vlogmas. I want you guys to be super involved and I'm just like really excited. So love you guys so much and I will see you soon. Bye. I don't want a lot for Christmas.